but they are already a seasoned drone pilot looking to capitalize on new opportunities or someone who's simply intrigued by the idea of drones and making money, this list has something for you. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the industries where drones are going to be making the biggest impact in 2025 and careers that you may want to look at as a drone pilot. My name is Elon, and this is the Pilots of the Caribbean podcast channel. And in this video, we're going to go over the top five career opportunities for drone pilots in 2025. One of the most obvious applications and by extension careers for drone pilots is in the field of aerial photography and videography. From shots of beautiful landscapes, which we have a lot of here in the Caribbean, to acrobatic aerial shots for films and television shows. Professional photographers and videographers are increasingly turning to drones to add that little extra element to their work. And we are at the point now where there really is no turning back. Having drone shots in your video now is a must. And these guys are doing stuff with drones now that weren't possible before. Or the things that you could do were only possible with expensive helicopter setups. Or sometimes not even really possible at all, depending on the budget or lap thereof. And a great example of this is, uh, do you guys remember the movie Bread Notice? Uh, well, Johnny FPV was the pilot to film the drone footage for this movie. And just as a side fun fact, Red Notice is one of the first feature films to exclusively use FPV drones for the cinematography. So from these shots, a drone pilot, and in this specific example, a FPV pilot that really knows how to take full advantage of his FPV drone to capture these types of shots. And this is just one of so many other similar situations. And I think it's fair to say that all types of drones will remain regulars and will really always have a place on movie and TV sets in the future. Next on the list is agriculture. And agriculture is one of the most promising sectors for drone technology. The kind of things that drones are capable of now could totally change the way that farmers perform you know, what we consider traditional farming practices. With the kinds of advanced sensors that you could put on drones, you could capture everything from detailed images of crops, which would you know, allow farmers to monitor things like plant health and detect pests and diseases, to even as far as identify nutrient deficiencies with these sensors. This kind of early detection would enable you know, interventions, which in the long run you'll get healthier crops and higher yields. Uh, drones can also create high resolution maps of the fields, which will also then go on to provide high valuable insights into topology, soil composition, how the crops grow in, and these maps could also help farmers when they're implementing planting patterns, doing things like irrigation systems, fertilizer application, and all of this in the long run just basically increases efficiency and reduces costs. I will not forget livestock farmers because drones can also offer a tool to monitor their herds, track the movement of their animals, identify sick or injured animals, and can even count the number of animals in a herd. Using this technology would only just save time and effort, particularly for farmers with larger herds. Third on the list is construction, and the construction industry is undergoing a dramatic transformation thanks to the integration of drone technology. These drones are revolutionizing the way construction practices are conducted, offering real-time data and aerial perspectives that enhance project management, enhance safety, and enhance site efficiency on a construction project. You could use drones to quickly and accurately map construction sites, create detailed training models, and pass these models on to help your architects, engineers, and project managers visualize the project and make informed decisions about it. And now, by regularly monitoring your construction projects with drones, project managers that identify delays or issues early on which could allow them to put corrective actions in place easily and you know, ensure that your projects stay on schedule and within budget. You could also use drones in construction to inspect hazardous and hard to reach areas, you know, like the top of tall buildings or confined spaces without putting workers at risk. And this would just further reduce safety risk and improve your overall efficiency. So construction, you can also use drones to accurately measure stockpiles of materials, you know, like gravel, sand, dirt. And um, this information is now essential to your inventory management and your cost estimation. All in all, using drones in construction leads to improved efficiency, cost savings, and enhanced safety, making it a very attractive field for drone pilots to get into. Right. Now, 
before we continue, let's address the elephant in the room, artificial intelligence. And if you've been staying up to date with drones or really any type of technology within the past few years, you've probably seen that AI is gradually becoming a part of our everyday lives in ways that we didn't even think were possible. And drones are no exception to that. By doing the research for this video, some of the top comments and concerns I was finding were people saying that in the next few years, drones will be so automated that human pilots won't be needed anymore, or at least to the extent that they're needed now. And I wanted to address this really quickly and point out why I truly believe that drone pilots will still be relevant in the new age of AI. Despite advancements in technology, I would argue that drone pilots won't be relevant. Understanding drone technology, expertise in the field, and the ability to educate your clients are just a few of the things that you really can't replace. Pilots will continue to contribute to AI training, whether we like it or not. But adapting to new developments and networking within the industry are a few of the ways for us to stay informed and ahead of our AI curve. And what I mean by that is basically continuously learning and adapting will be the key to thriving in the evolving drone industry and whatever part AI has to play with. Now, with that said, uh, let's continue on to the rest of the list of the top five career opportunities for drone pilots in 2025. Number four on the list is, the, is energy. And the energy sector, including oil, gas, and renewable energy, has really embraced drone technology to improve efficiency, safety, and monitor the environmental impact. Drones offer a safer and more efficient way to inspect critical infrastructure like pipelines, power lines, wind turbines, and solar panels. You could equip drones with sensors that can identify issues like leaks, corrosion, and damage, which would then allow for timely maintenance and repairs. Additionally, things like thermal imaging capabilities would enable drones to detect heat anomalies like electrical faults or hotspots in solar panels, ensuring that they perform the way they're supposed to and prevent potential hazards. Additionally, drones can monitor environmental conditions around energy facilities, tracking air quality, water levels, vegetation health, and this will all ensure compliance with environmental regulations and really minimize the impact of energy operations on the environment. By leveraging drone technology, the energy sector can enhance safety, reduce costs, and improve the reliability of energy supply making it a really promising field for drone pilots in 2025. Last on the list is surveying. And surveying has been identified as one of the most profitable of all the segments. Uh, surveying continues to be the, one of the most sought after drone related services in the industry and is expected to witness double digit growth in the next 10 to 15 years. Drones allow professional surveyors to easily build a great number of deliverables for their clients. For example, if you have a wide open area, a drone with a high-end LiDAR equipment could cover this five to 700 acres in a day. And the amount of data collected in that time could be turned into point clouds, digital elevation models, contour files, 3D models, and so much more really. When it comes to surveying, the opportunities are vast. And since the demand for land surveys arises from many other sectors, including construction, agriculture, mining, inspections, conservation, environmental things, and you know, the list goes on and on. The surveying industry is a huge avenue for drone professionals that are looking to build a career. So something to consider. So what do you think about this list? Do you think I missed something out? Do you think there's something that you would have put differently or a different order on the list. Now, this list was in no particular order, but you know, if you have your comments about it, if you think that there are other opportunities that should have made the list, let me know. Drop it in the comments below. I'd always love to hear from you guys. And like and subscribe for more videos, and I will see you in the next one.